Hey, I gotta go out. I haven't shaved or any stuff like that. I probably do for a haircut. Um, but I haven't been to the barber. Last time, I have a real good barber, but last time he cut my hair, and my hair is like straight and on top, and it's just because um, it's thinning. And, but you know, you can only like cut it. And I've always had kind of wavy hair, but you can only cut it like one direction at a time. And I don't know why he went back like this and it just, oh man, he cut it so low. It was terrible. I didn't like it. But usually he does a great job. So eventually I'll get it cut again if it fills back in. If. <laughs> anyway, I got to go to a uh, opening. I am. I don't know if I can share this or not, but I uh, applied for a grant um, for my film, and uh, I have a sponsor, and hopefully it'll come through soon. It's a uh, if it does, I'm just gonna go right ahead and start with my film. Uh, it should be okay though, because um, I. Um, I basically, uh, I, I have a sponsor and I've been at it a long time. It's just time, you know, it's gonna happen. So uh, so then I have a very, very limited budget and and I'm gonna take a year and that's what I'm about right now. I'm sacrificing parts of my life in order to accomplish certain goals because I'd rather have said I've done it or even tried to do it than say I have not done it at all. So. Def definitely gonna get there. I want to be 50 years old and say I've gotten a couple of movies done, and um, instead of you know 70 and saying I've never done anything. So um, anyway, when I was 20, I was a wild artist cat. This is I'm going to the artist reception now, and so it's a big event, a big event, and I'm really running late, but uh, I'm gonna head out, get out of here. But I just wanted to say. Uh, when I was 20, I was kind of a wild cat, really wild, and I lived my life, and I, like I say, I've been around the block a couple of times, and just fun, crazy kind of guy, and, you know, I don't live like that anymore, uh, generally, and I generally try not to, so, but I wanted to say something, I used to drink, I was such a wild guy, and I stopped drinking, and um, drinking would just make me wild and crazy. I mean, I was crazy. And, uh, one time, I would do just wild stuff, you know. I would just, I remember there was just two hot blondes, right? And they were getting in a Camaro. And I was coming down the street, and I said, like, hey, how you doing? She said, I'm fine. She said, wow, you're beautiful. I said, can I get a kiss? She said, mm. I walked up to that chick and just mouthed the shit out of her. Right there on the street, never met her before. Jumped in the car, we was zooming down the street. And I had a beer cans with her. She wanted the beer cans and then the door flew open and I was halfway out of the car. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> I was halfway out of the car, it was raining, it was crazy. Oh, anyway, I didn't want to go here. <laughs> I just wanted to show you. I wanted to demonstrate why I don't drink. That's one demonstration. Let me show you. I'll just show you. Pretend this is like beer or alcohol or something. And I would drink. reception I am not having one drink not one box of punch or anything so I'll be sitting there talking to him and I'll be like yes do you see the uh, motif and how it, it relates to the different parts of the 
of the composition and the distributed painting and the nuances of uh, that neocentric type of <laughs> yes and uh, how it's um, composed with a way and a sensitivity that the artist just really just put his all into it I just try to, I just try to, try, try to warn you, you know, if you can't, you can't hack it, just don't, don't go there, you know, I mean, you know, so anyway, I wound up putting the um, bottle down, I wound up picking up the computer, and doing things with my life that I didn't even think I, I could, and were possible, and I wouldn't have done them either if, if, if I had kept drinking it, it's like, you know, you know, put put down the bottle and become a computer scientist, you know. Anyway, God bless you. Just wanted to share a moment before I get out of here.